creating stunning, visually attractive and informative presentations manually and without the help of AI is a pretty difficult task. Because searching for all those points in the writing by yourself is pretty inefficient and not a very bold move. But what if I tell you you can use ChatGPT in PowerPoint to create stunning presentations and that's so in less than 10 minutes. Yep, don't worry office mates, I got your back. But before we move forward, I would like to tell you that B10X has an exclusive AI tool workshop. Do check it out, link is in the description. If you are someone who got salary hike below 20% in 2023, it is because you haven't upskilled enough and it is because you are not adding that much value to your organization. If you are planning to get 80 to 300% salary hike in 2024, that is possible if you learn and if you start using AI tools and chat GPT for doing your work. So alright, to make a good presentation, you need to divide your task and make steps of it. So our first step is gonna be finding out the topic. And today I'll be choosing health versus wealth. Yep, this will be our topic for today and we'll make a presentation on it. And for that, go to ChatGPT and write a prompt there, which is create a powerful PowerPoint presentation on a topic health versus wealth. Make sure you put it in inverted commas with full slides and latest information. You have to write this prompt and give it to ChatGPT just to replace our topic, which is health versus wealth. You can type your own topic. And now ChatGPT will run the prompt and find the best points of information and place them in the slide format. Now, as you can see, it has given you points for different slides and you can even increase the number of slides accordingly. Now, we finally have the information, but how will we convert it in PowerPoint presentation? Yep, I'll tell you how to do that. But before we move forward, I would like to warn you with something. See, AI is taking over the world. In such a short span of time, we have seen so many layoffs, millions of jobs being replaced by AI and whatnot. And you don't want to get affected by this recessive wave, right? Well, AI won't replace you. The people using AI will. If you want to save a job and become irreplaceable in your career, join our three hours of AI tool workshop in which we'll teach you about the best AI tools to upskill, increase your productivity and enhance your career. Make your future secure with us. Join our workshop by clicking the link in the description. All right, so let's move ahead. Our next step would be to open MS Word and create a blank project there. Then from the top menu, click on view, then click on outline and it will provide you with another blank project. Then go to chat GPT, copy everything that it generated and then paste it in your Word document. Now, after pasting the information there, there is some manual work you have to do it by yourself, which is removing these points thing. Remove them from all the points. We don't need them now. Now, the last thing you have to do here is select all the information and then look for the body text. Click on drop down arrow and choose level two there. And now you have to select all the titles of the slides. Make sure you're pressing control key to select multiple at the same time. Now save your current document to wherever you want. Just remember where you save it, okay? Now you may close the MS Word, we don't need it anymore. All right, now open PowerPoint presentation, then click on insert and then new slide and then click on slide from outline. Now select the document from your file section, then click on insert. Now you have slides. Now the information you got from chart GPT would have automatically been placed into different slides of PowerPoint. Now our next step would be to decorate this slide. For that, you can do two things. The first is creating a very stunning website and the second is creating a normal website. To create a normal and not that high five presentation, you can use PowerPoint's design option. There you'll get pretty decent designs. If you don't want to create that amazing or that flashy presentation, you can go ahead with this option. It's pretty easy. Okay, you just have to click on that design tab. You can surf through all those designs and find out whichever suits the best for your presentation and go ahead with it. It's pretty simple, right? Now, if you want to create a rather flashy presentation or some amazing presentation, what you have to do is you have to go to some AI generative art tools. For example, we'll go to Mid Journey or Leonardo AI Canvas and then type there a prompt to give you an amazing presentation page for whatever your topic is, make sure you mention that topic or that thing won't work. And then it's gonna give you four different designs. And then just grab any design you want and then download that design and go to your presentation again and use the design you just downloaded. And boom, there you go, you have every single thing. Your presentation is ready. See, we made two different presentations today the normal one and the advanced one. And if needed, you can even adjust your text and all that stuff, that's all. But yeah, you cannot change the fact that you just created an amazing presentation from scratch. And just with the help of AI tools, we haven't searched anything in Google, we haven't done any brainstorming to make anything, we just used AI tools and it was a pretty simple workflow, right? So alright, tell me in the comment section what type of presentation you made. Did you made it for office use or your college use? 
and also which method you used the advanced one or the basic one well personally i'll recommend you to use the advanced one because it creates basic website but one step ahead because we are using ai generative art tools which takes the designing to another level so i recommend you to use that all right so don't forget to like the video subscribe to the channel share this video among your friends and hit that notification bell also do check out our ai tool workshop link is in the description it is super cheap and very informative so do check it out link is in the description we'll see you there thank you